Good morning, welcome back to Hillstown Farm. It's another one of those cracking days. <laughs> the sun is shining again. The grass is growing slowly. Promised a bit of rain at the weekend, so hopefully we'll get just freshened up a bit. It should be nice. We should see the grass bursting out of the ground once it gets a bit of rain. We've got a few jobs on today. Uh, really took loads of cattle in the Balamina this morning. Got to the market, uh, fat cattle. The shed's starting to clear now. It's getting a bit warm and well, it's warm. Well, it's actually cooler in the house than it is out in the fields, so I think the cattle are happier in the house at the minute because it uh, takes that sun off their back. So especially the darker ones, they're, they're roasting. <laughs> so, my cows out here at the minute, they are absolutely scorched. Right, so we'll get this trailer cleaned out. Get a few other wee jobs done today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, ring that bell, and we'll get one out. Pretty quickly at the minute now, I have to admit. Trinker didn't work. I've just ripped it clean off. I thought with the weight of the water in it, it would just sit. No. I've lost two cubes of water. Ha! At least I made the grass grow, if nothing else. Some of these hallions has decided to play with it. It's a bargain. I'm going to clean out the trailer today. Get done quickly. Do it the fast way. Yeah. Job done. Ta da! Nice when it's handy like that. To be fair, it took me an hour and a half. I haven't washed in a couple of weeks and it was stuck to it like glue. I've got the pain in the backside, but I've got it. I'll keep the quality assurance boys happy. Just as we mentioned, quality assurance. They're just out to torture, so I'll just go back with you. Just out to torture. So, this bin takes all our beef mix. So we put it all in there. We put the pig feed into this one. Yeah, but do not confuse. It's like bigger, big 12 ton bin, as opposed to a 6 ton. We had to write on the bin what we have in it. So, a big black marker and I put a big finisher. Goes back to front. Number two doesn't matter. No, no, no. No, no, I'll be too simple. Here to say to torches. They can make me something new every year. And uh, I think it's just to. Uh, Give them something to do, I think. Take them our box and keep the farmers on their toes. Alright, so tonight we're going to clean out the diet feeder, give a wee clean out, give a brush out, because we're finished with it this year. Because it's so little in the house now. We only need, what I think, about five buckets a meal in the morning, five in the evening, I think it worked out. So we'll just do it by hand. Means we'll be able to put in the meal a wee bit fresher, we'll eat it fast, and the birds won't eat it. Because at the minute we're feeding birds, not only really feeding birds, but uh, it's quite an expensive way to feed birds. So the plan is to stop that, feed them by hand. So should be a big thing. There only is I don't know when he's in there, not that many. Like 20, 20 cattle left. So quite a lot of way today. If we get into the shop, that's us really pretty handy. It's a nice time of the year. So we'll get the thing cleaned out, and then we'll hook her off, part away. Not her finish for the year. Well, until September again, we'll start again. Plus the fact is we're only putting in half a bale of silage between this lot for two days. And it's not even chopped up. we we'll hardly chopped up that well. So chopped up well and it's a full load. Half load, maybe not, just as good. Let's go and take a look. See how much is in her. Probably not be that much. Oh, not too bad. A wee bit. A wee bit laying down there. We'll just turn around and Brush her out. Not that big a deal. If I left it and it'd just be clean rotten by the time we go to use it in September. And we put a lot of rotten silage and sour meal into the cattle and not a good start, really. Night, all cleaned out. Camera turned off, off his so you know it's getting fed up. Just off the ground. We're not climbing in there, it's not the safest place to go. We'll get this thing hooked off. And Carson back, she was out lifting the chiller. The water drinkers, which don't work anymore. I need to fix that. Tell the wee frame for the bigger one. Well, we've got the sore on. At last. At long last. At the minute, they're given 70% chance of rain all on Saturday. Which is good enough for me. If that's. We'll see what it's like in the morning, basically. But well, I think the fertilizer on before the rain comes. It's a long and short of it because you don't know what's going to be coming next week. You like my sunroof? 
That's Cara's done that. See the undog? She broke my sunroof. Yeah, broke it. Yeah. I don't think it's broken, I think it's just sitting over the top. So. But it's a good job, basically. You don't have to wear a hat because your head gets burnt. We're going now to put the topper on. So we have the sprayer upon the topper. She's going to top a lot of weeds. And then they say they shouldn't really be topping during a drought. Cutting are not going to need the shot bits anyway, so why not just cut them off? At least it's starting to come. So that's the, the plan. So we'll maybe top a few fields too. There's a few fields maybe just get a wee bit ahead. Top in a fertilizer, that's the aim of the game this week. See how that goes. And rain, I want rain. We don't rain. Just not, not, not much. Since we haven't used the topper as for quite a while, of course it's in there. Behind the quad, we use the shift of the pallets, sprayer, microwave oven. Do not ask why. There's a microwave oven sitting right in the middle, commercial. And we want to buy it, doesn't work. Make a nice ornament in your kitchen. And a few other bits and pieces, but we'll get it moved. Out. 10 points for everything you hit on the way out the door. Oh, very smart. Oh. Oh. Nice and gently. Oh, just keep her going. Oh. She's right hollow, isn't she? Right, so we need to put the arm down a wee bit. She's a bit low. Set her down. Or not, it's good to go. Bad grease. Set her down. What else? So we got a wee bit of gear oil. We have a wee bit in that corner. And a wee bit of grease in the shafts. Cars is going to start it up now. we will call it a day today um thanks for watching please like and subscribe ring the little bell and get our video out hopefully tomorrow see you in the next one